My name is Roswitha. I'm from Austria. Um, I live in Vienna, but I grew up in Graz. My field of work is um, mostly based on graphics. I, I guess I'd say I'd come from drawing a lot, but I'm always trying to broaden this field up much more, like uh, have drawings, uh, getting into animations and uh, trying to think drawing as a part of an installation. When I came to Kosice, one of the first things was that we got this leaflet from Suska and like basic information about Kosice. And all the different suburbs were listed there. Like this is Kavabö, this is um, Nadia Serwan, whatever. And it was the first chapter and I was like, okay, so the first information you get is like the housing complexes and blah, blah. So I started asking, I don't know, Babora and Suska, blah, 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 some things. And the second thing Babora told me was that she doesn't that she doesn't understand why people always come here and want to work with the tower blocks because it's living quarters we live there it's just basic it's normal it's whatever so i found this really interesting that like on the one hand um it's like presented to artists from the foreign country that this is tower blocks in kosice as like a really important thing on the other hand it's like it's living quarters it's just really everyday things or something like this and so this is also how my project here kind of started. Two thousand years, some archaeologist comes here to Kosice or to Slovakia and finds like all these colorful buildings with all the the patterns of the coloring schemes of the tower blocks or something. And then he starts or she starts uh, an analysis about the meaning of the of the, the patterns. There is no meaning, but I'm inventing a meaning. So I'm inventing different kinds of meanings because we've already, like there, there are a couple of theories already that like archaeologists or generally we try to over analyze uh, things from the past or things we don't know. Like just some little thing you dig out of the mud could be, it's def definitely a, a temple, you know, kind of all of these things or something. and. So currently I'm working on several theses, that one is that they kind of developed under the Mendelian laws of inheritance. So in the beginning there was a pink one, a pink tau block and the orange tau block and they started mixing up and then how that's all how the how all the tau blocks kind of, you know. Another part of the project is going to be these models of how the paint is actually looking or the appearing on the actual surface of the yeah, house. The Isola painting company is going to make me lots more of these um, examples or something. And what I want to do is like walk around the tower blocks, the suburbs and ask people to kind of adopt the color, which I mean with um, invent a name for the color, maybe have an association with the color, maybe have a little sentence for the color or whatever, just put something on it. of my exhibition is going to be within a lonesome group which kind of refers to as the thing that you're within a group but you're somewhere so there are several groups and I'm not talking about being lonely but more about being, being um, geographically kind of displaced somehow which also refers to me being here like being in a group in a group of other residents in Kasana as a group in Kojice as a group like the idea of a group you know um, but being still like away from home kind of thing and being not really connected with each other, like with the other groups because I didn't get to know so many people in three months or something. But also, it also refers to the situation with the tower blocks because like tower blocks or the suburbs, uh, I would call them also like a group maybe or like each tower block is a group of people. 
So they're within a group, they're in one suburb, they belong to Kosice, it's a bigger area, they belong in Slovakia, kind of like this. So I'm, yeah. And also that my exhibition is going to be like mainly about the Tower Blocks project, but also some sketches and other things I did here. So also like the idea was also to ask if an exhibition can also be kind of a group and it's lonesome. It's gonna be lonesome in empty Bravo building somewhere in the second floor. <laughs>